Okay. All right. Hi, everybody. My name is Abby Lai. I am with Homeschool Coaches. I've been doing this for about eight years, and I am so excited that we have expanded and now added Ad Life. That is another website where we get to showcase all sorts of really, really amazing instructors. Today I have with me Dave Christensen. You will see him here with us as well. And um, I want to tell you, as you're looking into the new semester, a lot of times people look at the new year and they think, what am I going to do differently? What didn't work during fall? A lot of people also look at what other things are fun that my kids would enjoy. A lot of times that includes music. This is a good time to check out piano, guitar, all sorts of great things. And that's why I have Dave here with me. Dave, could you tell us a little about yourself and the instruments that you teach? Uh, sure. Uh, I've been uh, teaching music for about uh, over 20 years, maybe closer to 25. Um, it's my passion. I love doing it. Um, I, I also perform. Um, I worked in the film industry uh, on the music side of things for a few years, uh, but it just it didn't fulfill me. Uh, so I really jumped back into teaching after uh, I left Disney, and um, and then with the pandemic, you know, we had to kind of restructure everything now that we can basically be anywhere in the world. So the past few months, I've really been focusing, or actually, yeah, past year. <laughs> The year went quick. Um, I've really been focusing on how to offer um, different packages to fit different lifestyles because uh, everyone's kind of looking for something different. Um, one of the new things that I developed that I'm really happy with is the clubs. And it's this is for kids that already know how to play but are looking for a place to hang out with other musicians. Um, uh, so they can come and they can share what they've been working on, but also uh, there's a teacher there if they're struggling like how do I play this or I'm struggling with uh, this chord or this song, I can guide them and help instruct them on how to play the songs. So it's a class, but it's also kind of a place to hang out with other musicians, develop friendships, <clears throat> uh, start a community. So I have a guitar club. <laughs> a songwriting club, and a ukulele club. And uh, those have been going really, really well. We have a great time. And Dave, I got to say, this is one of the reasons I think you're amazing is because you not just know how to teach this, but you have the heart because during this season, kids want to connect with other people. And so often they're just sitting in the class and they're not able to talk to anybody else. And how wonderful for your kids um, for any parents out there to have a class where your kids are engaging, they're having fun, they're meeting other people guided by someone that's highly experienced, someone that's been doing this, like Dave said, for 20 years. It's not just a hobby on the side. This is what he does. And what's really cool with you, Dave, is that you're one of the only instructors I know that can teach kindergarten to seniors in high school. And that takes quite a personality because usually most of the instructors, they're early elementary or they're elementary or they're high school. They can't do both. Can you tell us a little about your classes? Because I've been in awe. You've got classes for K to third grade where they're moving around and having fun at just like your clubs with the older kids. Um, <clears throat> yeah, luckily, uh, I had the experience when I lived in Illinois of being a substitute teacher. So I had to learn how to teach and get along with all these different age groups. Um, and then, then I got a permanent job as a high school teacher before we moved out here. Um, but that was really trial by fire, like learning how like each of the groups, because teaching individually is different, teaching private lessons, you know, you're only with one kid and one personality, and it's pretty easy. Um, having like one day teaching kindergarten and the next day teaching fourth grade and jumping around from class to class was a great education and learning how to uh, deal with all the different ages. I'm naturally just a very patient person, very good natured. Um, I uh, recently became a cancer survivor, uh, so I really understand how important it is to love what you do because life is precious and uh, and um, 
it's it can be short. <laughs> but uh, I am cancer free now. I'm going to be around for a long, long time. And uh, yeah, uh, out of everything I do, teaching is the most fulfilling and the most fun um, uh, thing that I get to do with my time. So. Um, and <clears throat> I know there's a lot of classes out there that, um, or there's a model where they want to fill up the class, you know, more kids, more income. But when I was restructuring my business, I really thought it was important to keep the class size small, but just offer more classes um, throughout my day. So I keep my class size to five kids. Um, other, I'm not to, not to say that other subjects shouldn't do that. I, I'm an English major as well. I could probably teach five or I could probably teach 10 or 15 kids in an English class. But with music, I found anything above five just gets really confusing and kids can kind of slip into the background a little bit more and not get the attention they deserve. So I found limiting my class size to five allows me to spend individual time with each kid uh, during the 55-minute the, uh, class. And that's been working out great. I feel less stressed. I feel like I can connect with the kids more. And, um, and, it's, and it's, it's still worth my while. It still pans out for the stuff, you know, having to pay bills and all that. It, it still uh, is, is very doable and workable. It just makes the experience so much better uh, for, for everyone uh, for music classes when you can keep them small. The only class <clears throat> that I have that can enroll to like 10 or 15 kids is my music geography club. And that's because we're singing, we're dancing, we're playing. It's not so much instruction, it's more for little kids where each, uh, each week we go to a different country and learn about their culture, uh, their dance, their food, their music. Um, so that class can be a little bit bigger because there's no instruction involved. It's just jumping around, playing games, having fun. But all my instruction courses and my clubs, I keep to five students to make sure that everyone can uh, uh, get the attention that they need and that they can't fall into the background. <laughs> I love it. This is the time for parents to be able to get to know Dave, check out his classes on Ad Life, and you've heard from him, he's super patient. He is used to all the different age ranges and just being ready for whatever may come up in these different classes. But how wonderful to have a group class of only five kids. You know, his classes include ukulele, um, guitar, piano, all beginning, and also that geography, a um, music geography class sounds amazing where kids don't have to sit and be still in front of the computer. They can be moving around and singing and having fun, and that's one of the best ways to learn. Now, I got to say, I was reading your bio, and it says that music interacts with other subjects such as math, English, and science. What do you mean by that? So uh, part of the group classes and the private lessons <clears throat> that I teach, um, I take a little part of each class to show kids how music interacts with their other core subjects. So music has a lot of math in it, especially fractions. So we'll have a lesson on how math looks under the guise of music. Um, English, like I have students pick a song that they like and explain to them that lyrics are just poetry and then they have to kind of do a presentation of reading the lyrics and explaining to us what they think the lyrics mean. Science, we talk about sound waves, how sound waves travel into the ear, how two sound waves can kind of bump against one another and create different sounds and emotions. Um, geography, uh, we for all my classes, there's a lesson where we go around the world and I have tons of instruments back here uh, and in the back room. Uh, so I can like, when we go, I can show them the steel drum from Jamaica and the didgeridoo from Australia and the classical guitar from Spain. So um, just so they can see how important music is because it infuses so many of their different subjects. And it's such an important thing to understand. Um, and that's the, the other thing uh, that, uh, that I...
I want kids to understand music when they take lessons with me. Um, so what that means is that you can learn how to sight read and you can learn how to play a song, but really not know what is behind that, what, um, how or why doing this creates this, why a major chord makes us feel happy, why a minor chord makes us feel sad. Um, so that's, uh, so that's a big part and it's theory. But um, when I grew up, when I was 10, my piano teacher uh, found a way to teach me college level jazz theory and it stuck. Um, so I've taken that and kind of modified it so I can teach six and seven year olds about theory in a way that's accessible to them. Um, so that's, that's a really important part of my curriculum to make sure they understand music. And if they understand it, they can play it better, they can feel it better, and they're more involved than just going through the motions. It, it gets them more involved in, in what they're doing. Amazing. So I was really lucky to have a visionary piano teacher when I was growing up in, in Chicago. Excellent, and it clearly has influenced you and in how you teach and your love for teaching as well. You know, I just wanna tell everybody, if they're interested in Dave's classes, go to the Homeschool Coaches website. You can click on Ad Life. Simply put in Dave under the coach name and you will find his long list of classes. They start the week of July, excuse me, January 25th. And they are about 14 weeks long. They are very affordable. They are $240 for 14 weeks. And it's super affordable, especially for kids who are simply exploring. They're not sure if they love piano. They're not sure if they love guitar. This is a great way for them to start. It's very affordable. And also, Dave offers private lessons in many different instruments, as he has mentioned. So I just want to encourage everybody, if you're thinking about music classes for your kids, no matter what grade they are in, Dave offers those classes. And again, Dave is so highly experienced. He loves what he does. And your kids are going to feel that. They're going to see it. You're going to see the difference. Dave, is there anything you want to add before we say goodbye? Um, one thing about the classes is that I do have first step classes that are only six weeks and only $110. So if you're not sure whether your, your kid is going to like the instrument, it's even more affordable and a smaller amount of time. Um, so you don't have to, um, Make, you know, spend 14 weeks to, to, to <laughs> see if you're doesn't like the instrument um if but you know your kids better than i if they are looking for a longer semester long experience the 14-week classes are great if they're not sure uh i teach first step classes in piano ukulele and guitar and um if they want to continue after that there's more options i can offer second step classes they can jump right into private lessons after that i've had uh students do both so um yeah so they're and then if they're really serious about it then it's uh the private lessons work out great for them uh the, and the last thing is that uh, I, I really hope to see you guys in my classes um i know music has enriched my life and gotten me through a lot of tough times uh it's created a lot of joy in my life and it's helped me see the world uh in a in a different way and that's the main thing that I want to share with these kids is that music can be fun, but there's also a discipline side to it as well that uh, creates character, helps them overcome challenges. Um, so fun and discipline and, and just being unique, uh, a unique person in the world is really what we stress here at Song Squared. So if you're looking for something like that, I'd love to see you in a couple weeks. Wonderful. And I forgot to add, if any families want to, they can sign up for a free trial. So feel free to check out any of Dave's classes free of charge. Simply register, click on free trial, and you are all set. Dave, thank you so much for your heart, your combination of just all that you mix into your classes. We are so proud to have you as one of our teachers here. So I hope everybody has a great rest of your week, and thank you so much. Bye, everybody. Thank you, Abby. Bye.